Hi everyone, so this is question uh, 4, tutorial sheet 4. So the question says find the determinant of each given matrices. So in this question, uh, what you just need to understand is that when finding the determinants, normally we use what we call minors. So a minor is just any, any 2 by 2 matrix any two by two matrix uh, yeah it's, it's just any two by two matrix uh, in that way I don't know if you can understand it that way so let's take for instance if X um, oh sorry but let's take for instance if X is your matrix with the elements A B C and D so this one can be called a minor so finding the determinant of this x, so these are types of uh, brackets, or this is a symbol for the determinant. So you just have to multiply, you just cross, you multiply this a times b, a times b, and then you subtract c times b there, you get your bc. So this is how you find your determinant. So now, having known this, let's try to find the determinant of i. So the determinant of i there, which is a. So the determinant of this a is going to be equal to. You multiply this 2 times negative 2, you get your negative 4. You cross multiply them. And then you say minus. Uh, 4 times 3 minus you open brackets and then 4 times 3 you get your 12 so the 12 then so all you need now there is just simplify so you simplify negative 4 minus 12 which gives you now to be your answer to be negative 16 hence the determinant of a there is equal to negative 16 all right let's move on to the next question oh I don't know why I'm upset minded okay yeah question 2 so for question 2 you also do the same so question 2 B is equal to B is equal to uh, that so how you do this I'll copy it for the sake of uh, a certain stage in solving I'll copy it then one two three there's four there there's zero we have negative two then we have five then somewhere there there's three and negative one okay So finding the determinant of this. So find the, finding the determinant of B, what you do is you you write this one here. You reserve one line there. So I've decided to reserve this line here, which is 1, 2, and 3. So when I get the first number there, 1, I'll write it like that. And then I'll write, the, I'll, I'll write this symbol for determinant. So I'll write the minor of 1 there. So how do I find that uh, minor? Let me use a color, mm -hmm. red. So I'm going to cancel all the lines where this one is. So they we have one, one is in the first row there, and it's also in the first column. It's also in the first column. So whatever that I'm going to remain with this side, that's going to be my minor. So I'm going to write negative two there. I'm going to write 3 and then I'm going to write negative 1 and then 5 there and then I'll proceed to find in the next one sorry I'll write 2 so remember you have to write a minus 2 and not just a 2 minus 2 then open brackets so I'm going to close I'm going to cross all 
all the lines where these two is present both the row and the column so two is present in this row and in that column also oh, two is present in that row and in that column so this is simply telling me to say let me just use a different color okay so two is present in this column and then in this row so the remaining numbers are four uh, zero we have three and negative one So I'll write the next number there, which is a uh, positive three. So plus three. So positive three. I'll cancel this line and this other line this side. So I'm going to remain with four zero negative two five. I'm going to remain with four zero negative two and then a five there. Like that. And then so finding the determinant of B We're going to have so this one you find the determinant of this okay these symbols represent a, a determinant so negative two times one you get your uh, negative two times negative one you get your two and then three times five you get your 15 like that and then you move on to this minus two then open brackets four times negative one you get your negative four 0 times 3, you get uh, minus, uh, minus 0. Then you write your positive 3 there. Then open brackets. 4 times 5, you get your 20. Then 20 minus 0 times negative 2, you get your 0. So here again it's just a matter of simplifying. So this is going to be 1 open brackets 2, two minus uh, 15 you get your negative 13 there. And then and then negative 2 you write it there. Then open brackets negative 4 minus 0 you get negative 4 then uh, three there you open brackets then uh, three twenty minus zero you get your twenty and hence now we find uh, so one times negative thirteen you get your negative thirteen Two negative 2 times negative 4 you get your positive 8 and then 3 times 20 you get your 60 so when you simplify this you find your answer to be so 13 negative 13 uh, negative 13 plus uh, 8 just the same as 8 minus 13 which gives you a negative number which is a, a negative uh, negative uh, is it five yeah negative five plus 16 when you simplify this further you get your answer to be 55 so the determinant of B is equal to 55. All right, thank you very much. Let's move on to the next question. This is a uh, question two. So, sorry. We move on to question three. Question three, you do the same. I think we're done.
but uh, for the sake of revision let me do one of these of these remaining questions and after doing one of them the other one you can do it and then forward to me the solutions then i'll be i'll check and tell you whether it's correct or not so we move on let me answer also maybe um, i'll answer c you are going to I'll answer question four i'm going to try question three so question four is negative one c is equal to negative one zero six zero negative three then you have zero oh sorry you have zero there and then another zero and then you have two you have one so finding the determinant of this finding the determinant of this uh, uh, matrix you first uh, find uh, their minus their minor determinants so I'm going to get the first line I like using the first line because it's easier so this is a uh, so I'm going to have C, the determinant of C being equal to, so I'm going to write my negative 1 there, then my minor is going to be this part here, because I'm going to cross out this line and that line, so meaning I'm going to remain with 0, 0, 2, negative 3. I move on uh, to this one, so I'll say minus 0, and then I'll multiply uh, this 0 with the minus of 0, which is, uh, I'll cross out this line here, and I'll cross out that line, so I'm going to remain with the 0, 1, 0, negative 3. So going to remain with 0, 1, 0, negative 3. And then plus, I'll write my 6 there. Open bracket. Then, when I cross out this line, and that line, I'm going to remain with 0, 1, 0, 2. 0, 1, 0, 2. Like that. So the determinant of C will be nothing but, so I'll put this negative 1 outside, open brackets. I'll find the determinants of this minor matrices. So 0 times negative 3, I'll get a 0 minus. 0 times 0, zero uh, 2 times 0, you get a 0 there. And then I'm multiplying this 0 with everything there. Of course, I'll get a 0. So there I can just put a 0 in advance. When you multiply 0 with every, any number, you get a 0. So plus 6. And then open brackets. And then 0 times 2 you get a zero then one times zero minus you also still get a zero there so in short the determinant of c is going to be equal to uh, zero because when you multiply this one times zero there you get zero minus zero six times zero there you get a zero so the determinant of uh, So the determinant of uh, uh, this matrix is equal to zero. Thank you very much for watching the videos. So you can do question three and forward your solution to my uh, WhatsApp line. If you need clarification, and I'll be there to answer or respond in time. So forward your solutions to this line. Let me just zoom it a bit.
yeah so for your solutions to this line all right for your solutions to this line on the screen here and i'm going to answer you any question that you're going to ask if you have any contributions or any corrections you are free to forward them to this same line on whatsapp thank you very much for watching the video see you in the next tutorial video